Have you met a Boston Terrier? Well, I'm sure you have, but if you haven't, these adorable pups are known for their friendly, energetic personalities and their distinctive tuxedo markings. And have you ever wondered what makes the Boston Terrier such a special breed? Well, one of the things that makes Boston Terriers so unique is their tuxedo markings. These black and white markings give the breed a dapper and distinguished look, which is why they're often referred to as the American Gentleman. Follow along to learn more about these charming dogs and why they make such great companions. In this video today, we're going to be sharing the top 10 most interesting and surprising facts about the one and only Boston Terrier. But before we begin, we'd like to take a moment to express our thanks to all the original Boston owners who let us use their content in this video. The video would not have been possible without them. So don't forget to check out these adorable dogs from their Instagram profiles that have been linked in the description below. And now, let's begin the list. Number 1. Their History Although everyone agrees that the Boston Terrier came into existence in the late 1800s in Boston, Massachusetts, there are varying stories about how the breed came to be. One story has it that coachmen of wealthy families developed the breed by crossing bulldogs and the now extinct English White Terrier to create a new dog-fighting breed. Another account is that a Bostonian named Robert C. Hooper imported a Bulldog English Terrier cross named Judge from England in 1865 because he reminded Hooper of a dog he had had in his childhood. Yet another story is that Hooper purchased Judge from another Bostonian, William O'Brien, around 1870. While we may never know which story is true, the fact is that there was indeed a dog named Judge and that from him came the breed we know today as the Boston Terrier. But these dogs weren't called Boston Terriers in the beginning. They were called by various names including Bullet Heads, Round-Headed Bull and Terriers, American Terriers, and Boston Bulldogs. In 1889, about 30 owners of Boston Bull Terriers formed the American Bull Terrier Club and they called them Roundheads or Bull Terriers. Bull Terrier and Bulldog Fanciers objected to the name. Since the Bulldog contingency had a lot of power with the American Kennel Club at that time, the Boston Bull Terrier Fanciers decided that discretion was the better part of the valor and changed the name of their club to the Boston Terrier Club in tribute to the birthplace of the breed. The breed was recognized by the AKC in 1893. The Boston Terrier was one of the first non-sporting dogs bred in the US and was the first of the 10 made in America breeds currently recognized by the AKC. Number 2. Their Appearance The Boston Terrier is a small to medium-sized breed with a square-shaped head and a compact, muscular body. They typically weigh between 10 and 25 pounds and they have a short, smooth coat that is black, white, or brindle in color. One of the most distinctive features of the Boston Terrier is their tuxedo markings, which give the impression of a dog wearing a formal suit. They have a black face with a white muzzle and white markings on their forehead, chest, and paws. Some Boston Terriers also have a small patch of white on their back between their shoulders. Boston Terriers have small triangular ears that are set high on their head, and they have large dark colored eyes that are white set and expressive. They have a short broad muzzle with a black nose and tight fitting lips. Their tail is short and tapered, and it is typically docked to a length of about 2 inches. Overall, the Boston Terrier is a compact and well proportioned breed with a muscular and athletic appearance. They are known for their lively and alert expression, and they have a playful disposition that is reflected in their physical appearance. Number 3. Their Temperament The Boston Terrier is a gentle breed that typically has a strong, happy-go-lucky, and friendly personality with a merry sense of humor. These guys are known for their friendly and playful personalities and they're often described as being both intelligent and affectionate. Boston Terriers are generally good with children and other pets and they are known for their sociable and adaptable nature. These guys are also eager to please their owner and can be easily trained. They can be very protective of their owners, which may sometimes result in aggressive and territorial behavior toward other pets and strangers. Boston Terriers were bred for companionship, so they are not considered terriers by the American Kennel Club, but are still part of the non-sporting group. Both female and male Boston Terriers are generally quiet and bark only when necessary, although early training in this regard is essential. Their usually sensible attitude toward barking makes them excellent choices for apartment dwellers. Number 4. They're also known as American Gentlemen Boston Terriers are sometimes referred to as American Gentlemen because of their distinctive tuxedo markings which give the impression of a dog wearing a formal suit. This nickname originated in the late 19th century when the breed was first developed and recognized by the American Kennel Club. 
The nickname American Gentleman is also a reference to the breed's elegant and refined appearance, as well as their friendly and sociable disposition. Number 5. Boston Terriers vs. French Bulldogs Most people confuse Boston Terriers with French Bulldogs because they look a lot alike. You can tell them apart by their ears, though. Boston Terriers have pointed ears, while French Bulldogs have rounded ones. French Bulldogs have a broader and more pronounced bat face than Boston Terriers. French Bulldogs have a flat face with large round eyes, a short broad muzzle and a wide square-shaped head, while Boston Terriers have a more narrow and elongated face with a longer muzzle and a more square-shaped head. French Bulldogs are larger and heavier than Boston Terriers. They typically weigh between 16 and 28 pounds, while Boston Terriers are smaller with an average weight of 10 to 25 pounds. Number 6. They're easy to train. Boston Terriers are generally considered to be highly trainable dogs, and they're often used in obedience competitions and as therapy dogs. These guys are intelligent and eager to please, which makes them responsive to training and easy to teach new commands and tricks. Boston Terriers are known for their adaptability and willingness to learn, and they can be trained to perform a wide variety of tasks and behaviors. They're especially good at learning obedience commands such as sit, stay, and come, and they're also able to learn complex tricks such as playing dead, rolling over, and dancing. One of the keys to successful training with a Boston Terrier is to use positive reinforcement and rewards. These guys respond well to praise, treats, and other rewards, and they're less likely to become frustrated or bored if they are being trained in a positive and encouraging environment. Number 7. They require minimal grooming. Boston Terriers are a low-maintenance breed when it comes to grooming, and they do not require a lot of care and attention to keep them looking their best. Their short, smooth coat is easy to brush and groom, and they only need to be bathed occasionally as needed. Boston Terriers have a short, smooth coat that is black, white, or brindle in color. Their coat is fine and silky to the touch, and it is easy to brush and groom using a soft, bristled brush or a rubber grooming mitt. Boston Terriers do not shed very much, and they only need to be brushed once or twice a week in order to remove loose hair and keep their coat looking clean and healthy. They do not need to be bathed very often, and a bath every few months is usually sufficient to keep their skin and coat clean and healthy. Number 8. Their Exercise Needs Boston Terriers are a small to medium-sized breed of dog, and they have moderate exercise needs. They're energetic and playful, and they enjoy regular physical activity in order to stay healthy and happy. In terms of their exercise needs, Boston Terriers should be provided with at least 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise per day. This can include activities such as walking, jogging, playing fetch, and other physical activities that allow them to run and play. Boston Terriers are adaptable and can thrive in a variety of living environments, from small apartments to large homes with a yard. However, it's important to make sure that they have access to regular opportunities for physical activity and play in order to keep them healthy and happy. Number 9. Their Diet and Nutrition Boston Terriers are a small breed of dog, so their dietary needs will be different from those of larger breeds. In general, Boston Terriers should do well on high-quality dog food, whether commercially manufactured or home-prepared with their veterinarian supervision and approval. Half to one and a half cups of high-quality dry food a day divided into two meals would be ideal, but how much your adult dog eats totally depends on their size, age, build, metabolism, and activity level. Dogs are individuals, just like people, and they don't all need the same amount of food. It almost goes without saying that a highly active dog will need more than a couch potato dog. The quality of dog food you buy also makes a difference. The better the dog food, the further it will go toward nourishing your dog and the less of it you'll need to shake it into your dog's bowl. Treats can be an important aid in training, but giving too many can cause obesity, so it's a good idea to monitor their food intake and limit treats to prevent them from becoming overweight. Number 10. Their Health Boston Terriers are generally a healthy and hardy breed, but like all dogs, they can be prone to certain health conditions. These guys are prone to a variety of eye problems, including cataracts, glaucoma, and retinal dysplasia. These conditions can cause vision loss and blindness, and they require prompt veterinary care in order to prevent further damage to the eyes. Boston Terriers have a short, broad muzzle, which can also cause respiratory difficulties. These dogs are prone to conditions such as brachycephalic airway syndrome, which can make it difficult for them to breathe and can lead to other health complications. Boston Terriers are also prone to orthopedic problems such as hip dysplasia and luxating patella. These conditions can cause lameness and pain, and they require veterinary care in order to prevent further damage to the joints. 
it's important to work with a veterinarian to monitor your dog's health and to address any potential health issues as they arise. Alright guys, with that we've come to the end of our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Boston Terrier. Thank you so much for watching the video. Have you got any fun stories to share about your Boston Terrier? Do you have any tips for training a Boston? Please share them in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more fun facts about your favorite breeds, and I'll see you in the next one.